Ang Gat Dam is a concrete water reservoir and bankment hydroelectric dam that supplies Metro Manila and nearby provinces with water. The reservoir supplies about 90% of raw water requirements for Metro Manila through the facilities of the Metropolitan Water Works and Sewerage System. It irrigates about 28,000 hectares of farmland in the provinces of Bulacan and Pampanga. Angat Dam is located within the Angat Watershed Forest Reserve in Barangay San Lorenzo, Norzagaray, Bulacan. It supplies potable water to Metro Manila and powers a hydroelectric power plant. Angat Dam supplies potable water and energy to Metro Manila and nearby areas. Surrounded by lush greens, this place is also ideal for fishing, boating, and hunting. Natutuyo ang ilo. Still below its minimum operating level. Pumababa ang antas ng tub. Ganito ang sitwasyon. Project Ahon is a youth initiative that was co-founded by a group of college students that was inspired by the recent water crisis that occurred last March 2019, where Nangat Dam experienced a water supply shortage reaching critical levels, causing 90% of Metro Manila to be affected, and to attempt to be able to lengthen their supply, they opted to schedule water interruptions that occurred daily, as they failed to come up with a solution or prevention rather as water is an essential resource that is needed for survival on a daily basis. The importance of water resource management is to hopefully prevent a crisis like this from occurring in the future by learning from them. Today, as the world experiences multiple effects of unpredictable variables such as climate change, drought, and variables that are inflicted by mankind that has affected our water resources such as water pollution and water wastage. We here in Project Ahon would like to acknowledge that the Philippines lack the capability to survive another crisis in the future. That is why the need for preparation, prevention, and education is needed by our generation as we encourage innovations and changes in terms of protocols as this could have been easily prevented if it was managed better. The two sustainable development goals applicable are Goal 6, which ensures access to water and sanitation for all. This aims to provide everyone access to adequate and equitable sanitation and hygiene for all. Since the previous year, not everyone had access to a reliable water supply. And secondly, Goal 12 ensures stay sustainable consumption and production patterns. This would help in the prevention of the recurrence of the problem in the future and this encourages sustainable management and efficient use of natural water resources. And with that being said, I am Rai Kashano, co-founder and chief executive officer of here in Project Ahon. Let me pass you to JD to further discuss to you our vision here in Project Ahon. Thank you, Rai. Hi, I'm JD Formoso, the co-founder and chief operating officer of the Project Ahon. And I am Brian Martinez, the chief financial officer and fellow co-founder as well here in Project Ahon. We envision our project, Project Ahon, to ensure water security in the coming years and to lessen people's water supply sole dependence in Angkat Dam. This would be the solution to the increasing demand of water in Metro Manila and nearby provinces dependent on the Angkat Dam which experiences water shortage and affects the daily life of people, given that water is an everyday necessity. With additional water reservoir, there would be enough water supply for the people and would stop water shortages experienced by more than 100,000 households and 300 barangays. This project would provide enough water supply needed in every household for whatever reason that may be. With the creation of a new dam, the project will ensure quality and better sewage system that would be easily accessible to the consumers and they would have an efficient water supply. This project would not only create a new dam, but also envisions the efforts of this generation to attempt to restore the quantity and quality of our water resources, as it aims to educate the public regarding the matter. Through Project Ahon, we aim to provide quality service and economically sustainable water resources in Metro Manila through delivery of safe, adequate, and affordable water resources, and to promote awareness of water usage 
to the public and community, which would benefit by the people dependent on 96% water supply of the Angat Dam. For our mission, Project Ahon commits to build and maintain an economically sustainable and water system that would supply the needs of the people without compromising the biodiversity and natural structure of the environment and people around the project site. Ensure quality and accessible water supply and services in Metro Manila and nearby provinces through safe, sufficient, and affordable water supply without risking the health of the consumers. Encourage participation from the people to cultivate, educate, and promote awareness about water usage in order to remind about their social and environmental responsibility. Lastly, purposively manage the system and regarding the new dam in order to provide a quality project with the help of people's participation. Up next is Kiara to enlighten us with the importance of the initiative. I am Kiara Nazario, a co-founder and chief technology officer of Project Ahon. Doing this project helped us realize the importance of natural resources and the natural environment. It gave us an in-depth perspective of one of the most serious environmental problems that our country is facing today. We were able to apply some of the sustainable development goals in Project AHO, specifically SDG number 6, Clean Water and Sanitation, and SDG number 12, Responsible Consumption and Production. We were able to apply these two goals in Project Ahon as they served as a part of the concept of the project because it not only promotes reducing water shortage but also shows that there are alternatives that help to achieve these two goals mentioned. Another would be emphasizing the importance of biodiversity since water is an essential part of it. If water shortages continue to worsen then it will not only cause problems for us humans but also for animals and the environment since water serves as an important part in maintaining the equilibrium of the ecosystem and its biodiversity. This just shows most living things on the planet rely on water to survive and stay alive. And last would be water resource management as it emphasizes the importance of water. The planet has 71% of water covering it but only 0.024% of water is readily available to us. And despite having a low percentage of available water, we still manage to consume a lot of it. Water is a poorly managed resource and because of that, water shortages have become a serious problem around the world. This is the lesson that is very in line with Project Ahon as it shows how much water is being consumed and wasted despite already having supplies of it. We must not rely too much on one main water source but also find other alternatives that can fulfill other purposes in place of fresh water. And last but not the least to discuss our marketing plans of Project Ahon is Johan Lagazo. Hi, I am Johan Lagazo, the co-founder and chief marketing officer here in Project Ahon. As a lot of you would know, this project would benefit our society as a whole. And to pull this initiative off, we would need your support. And that is why we have partnered with the local government to educate the people the importance of our initiative, as well as various brands and organizations such as Kiwanis International, Rotary Club of Luzon, the Waves and Water Foundation, Blue Green Philippines, Mirola Hardware and etc. And celebrity ambassadors like Team Payaman, Ben and Ben, Paragon Clothing Line Philippines, Big Boy Company, Big Baller Brand PH, and many more. We have existing Project Ahon merchandise ranging from pins, shirts, masks, to water bottles, notebooks, and tote bags. All funds generated from these would fund our research and future projects as well. Join us as we aim for a better way of management of our natural resources, as we preserve it not only for us, but as well as the future generations to come. Once again, we are Project Ahon, 
and through joint efforts of our community, we believe that our small initiative could someday result in a bigger outcome.